John, aka Smelly Telly, and believe it or not, it is yet another beautiful spring afternoon. I know I say it every time, Larry can confirm today actually is a beautiful spring afternoon. I guess every time I do a video, the weather's just great. I don't know. It, maybe it's a little too hot. It's 80 degrees. So Anyway, I'm here in Evansville at More Music and MoreGuitars.com. Today I am holding a very special guitar I wanted to tell you about and kind of run you through uh, one of the things that you can have done through more music, which is the made to measure. So first, it's a Les Paul. You've seen one. It's not like a pretend. It's the actual Gibson Les Paul. This is a custom shop made to measure. So made to measure is basically you can work with this and you can spec out whatever kind of Gibson you want. You know, so if you want a certain era Les Paul or if you're wanting something absolutely specific, you can do all that through them. So for instance, this is a 59 standard and it has the Carmelita neck profile. Now to do that, they use lasers and robotics and all this crazy stuff to be able to get it. So it is the exact profile of the famous Carmelita Les Paul. If you don't know what that is, you can look it up on the interweb, you know, just type in Carmelita and Joe Bonamassa and you'll get it. So the neck profile on that, just to let you know, is it's a little bit slim slim for a 59. It's not quite a 60, but it's kind of like a transition in between. Uh, everything else is pretty standard for a 59 coming out of the custom shop. You know, you have the nylon nut. Of course, it's all mahogany and Indian rosewood fretboard. Uh, you have the custom bucker, uh, PAF style humbuckers. This is what I have on my Les Paul. It's pretty much the closest thing you can get to a vintage PAF that's coming out of Gibson. They sound great. If you're into the vintage PAF tones, that's what you're going to have with these. Everything else is the Les Paul. Let's talk about a little bit about the top though. So this is one of the benefits of the made to measure. Uh, you can pick out your top. So this was picked out by somebody here at More Music. I don't know exactly who. They can't even remember who exactly it was. It wasn't me. I wasn't involved in it. But this is beautiful. And of course, you'll see, Larry will put up some pictures and you'll be able to see it. Uh, and the finish on this is an Abilene Sunset Burst, which is, uh, it's just perfect. It's kind of a brownish red, you know, type of burst, which I think is just absolutely gorgeous. Uh, they did a fantastic job with this. And that's what you get. With the made to measure, you can tell them exactly what kind of top you want. You can tell them, you know, what the neck profile should be. You, you dream it and they can do it. And if you want some help doing that, you just come in or give us a call or get on our website and we'll start working with you right away. So since we're here and it is such a great guitar, I thought maybe I'd run through a couple of tones. There's nothing too groundbreaking here because it's, you know, it's a Les Paul. <laughs> and it's always funny to me when people try to redo the Les Paul because I'm just like, well, then maybe you don't want a Les Paul. You know, next thing you know, it's, it's much less of a Les I'm sorry. I just, that, was, that was awful. <laughs> All right, let's go through some tones. So we are running through, I believe this is the Paul Reed Smith. Is it the uh, Archon? Archon. Okay, I have never played through an Archon before. Um, it's got a lot of gain. We actually have had to bring back the gain a little bit. I think you've seen, we've put up a bunch of videos of them. We usually have Ed play through Archon because he's kind of our heavy specialist. He's nobody sounds as good in, in this building playing through heavy tones. I think so. Bridge pickup again. These are the custom buckers. So for me, the PAF sound has a little bit of honk to it. Some people will say, you know, it almost kind of sounds like a telly on steroids. Mm, maybe, I don't know. Roll back the volume. The 
that's one thing the custom shop has really done well is they really have nailed how to have a good taper on their volume pots on these, you know, modern but vintage Les Pauls. <laughs> to the middle position here. One thing that I like to do in here, and I'm not giving a lesson on Les Pauls, but I actually like to pull back the neck volume a little bit. So it still kind of has that bridge character, but it's a little bit less of it. And then when I want to kick it in, just flick it back. And we'll go to the neck and that kind of sustainy. kind of get that woman thing. Pretty cool. So if you love Les Pauls, this is, this is about as good as a Les Paul you're, as you're ever gonna get, trust me. Uh, let's do a couple of clean sounds. Why? I don't know why. We're gonna do it anyways. Middle position. And the neck position. So, should sound like a Les Paul because that's exactly what it is. I'll bite though, it's like a really fantastic Les Paul. So, if this is something that you're interested in, the made to measure, kind of building your dream Les Paul, or really any Gibson, please give us a call or come in and see us or get on the website at moreguitars.com. We can get you started. If you have any questions about it and about the process itself, our salespeople will walk you through it. Uh, it it'd be, it's a pretty cool experience. I actually do have a friend that went through this and it was just a ball for him. The whole thing was, was a, lot of, a lot of fun and um, maybe someday I'll get to do that too. Eh, we'll see. <laughs> I'm not for sure if I deserve it. My name is John. You can call me Smelly. Thanks for hanging out and watching, and I'll see you in the next video.